think about Richicho. I don't know how, uh, how my friend did it, to be honest. He's always he's always been incredible smart known him since grade two he went to the university of ontario institute of technology for nuclear engineering i went to the college on the same campus for computer systems technology dropped out after one year <laughs> i'm um, fine though but he managed to get good enough grades in year four of uni to get a job right off the bat and is now making over 100k per year and is literally already a millionaire due to crypto cool good on him he he was lucky enough to find uh, a discipline that he excelled in and i hope he loves that he's working in and he's immersed himself in everybody's not like that some people um it takes people sometimes a long time to find the discipline they want to be in sometimes many times people immerse themselves in a discipline they love it they do all this stuff they become like you said millionaires doing this and then after a few years they realize they don't they're not happy they don't want to do this they were just doing it because they were good at it right really because they were good at it now should you focus your life your energy just on things that you're good at no i think there has to be a certain amount of challenge i think there has to be a lot of novelty okay a lot of novelty thank you very much v62p for the cheers there has to be novelty you look in your life when you're graduating high school or whatnot i forget what the number is but the stat says that most people will change their careers if you want to think about as careers or their jobs multiple times in their lives right and that's the way it's been with me and that's the way it's been with most of the people that i know okay the ones who stuck just with the one thing that they're doing because first of all it's the ball and chain they get into a corporation they got their retirement plan they got their connections this is what they know they didn't spend the time to learn more things i don't give a rat's ass what you're doing learn something that is completely disconnected not not related to what it is that you're doing at work or your passion right so for example your friend is a nuclear physicist is in crypto and stuff like this fine and dandy right but if that's the only thing that he's doing he might get burned thank you very much matt for the sub right he might get burned right he needs to and i hope he's smart enough that he does have passions and interactions outside of that circle right whatever it is that you're doing make sure you have multiple different systems that you're engaging in because you learn things from those systems right and they may come a time where you don't want to be here and if you haven't at least created some pathways for you to enter different systems you're gonna have a hard time you're gonna have a seriously hard time okay that's one bit of advice i can definitely give you guys